I still seem to get this question a lot. Mick, how do you shoot cross-eyed dominant? Should I be shooting cross-eyed dominant? Why am I shooting cross-eyed dominant? A couple points. One, the pistol sights, they don't care what's lining them up. They're just a measuring tool, right? They're measuring the bore axis in relationship to whatever the bore is pointing at. So if me, cross-eyed dominant shooter, because I don't see so good out of this eye, if I mount the gun, my job is just to line those suckers up on whatever the target is. A lot of consternation about this. Well, I, I, it screws me up. No, it shouldn't at all. Watch, right eye, left eye, right eye, left eye. I can either slightly pivot the head or I can just slightly move the gun one way or another. There's not a lot you gotta think about. How do you know which eye is your dominant eye? Well, let's do this, this is super easy. You could maybe use my nose, but it'll probably be something you wanna do after the video. Make a small triangle there with your hand and maybe put it like on a light switch or some small object across the room. Look at that object through the little hole you're making in your hand and then slowly bring that back to your eye. You're naturally gonna pull it to whatever your dominant eye is. We put a lot of thought into this. There is not a lot of thought that needs to be put into it from my perspective, and I'm a cross-eye dominant shooter, so I think I know what I'm talking about. Your sights don't care what's lining them up. Place the gun in front of it, have your body somewhat squared and relaxed as we've taught you. Mount the gun, put it in front of your eye, press the trigger straight to the rear without disturbing the alignment of those sights. Boy, isn't this Langdon PX4 Beretta pretty darn sexy? It sure is. Stop overthinking stuff, guys. Line the sights up, press the trigger, don't disturb them, have a good, firm grip that is consistent. By consistent, I don't just mean consistent every time you grab the gun, it's the same way. I mean consistent in pressure. Don't allow it to change as that trigger is pressed. Keep it a, a consistent amount of pressure on the gun. Line it up, press away. Cross-eye dominance, it's not a thing. Anybody that tells you it's a thing and tries to make it too much of a thing, is making a thing out of a thing that doesn't need to be a big thing. Don't be a dickhead, be well. But one thing that we notice with our students is they just don't know how to line them up today. So that's what we're gonna look at. One of the things that we see off the bat that new students have a problem with is how do they align this thing? It's kind of funky, they don't know what to look at. We say equal height and equal light. Equal light means each side, you're centered up. So front sight post, rear sight, you're going to center them up in the target. Not left or right, not up or down, equal light. Light refers to left and right or windage, equal height, which is elevation, gonna be straight across. And this is gonna be pretty indicative of almost every uh, standard sight you're gonna see on a pistol or a rifle. What do you look at when you're sighting the, the pistol? Place the front blade over your intended target 